In this video, I'm going to explain to you what is the difference between Chinese remotes and the OEM remotes. As you can see, they both look the same, but inside the remote, the motherboard are a little different. As you can see, the chip is a lot smaller than the OEM chip. They both look almost the same but it's not so the biggest difference is the chip so you want to get the one that has a large chip which is the OEM chip compared to one of these tiny ones and this is the OHT remotes uh, the one that looks like these OHTs another example that I'm going to show you is, is these type They both look exactly the same. This is the um, LHJ011. Same, but they're not the same. This is Chinese, and this is OEM. Another example that I can show you is IYZs They both kind of look the same but as you can see the chip is the same as the uh, first one and the OEM chip compared to Kind of look the same from the inside as well, but they're not. Here's another example I'll show you on the forward um, key blanks. As you can see, when you open this one up, the Chinese one, you'll find one of these chip in there, the motherboard. And the original one has, it's kind of very hard to open, but I had this one opened up. And this looks like this. That has this type of buttons, and they're these type of buttons on them. And one more. This is a Koblier 1XT. The original one looks like this and this is a Chinese one so the main problem with the Chinese boards is that either they will um, not work close enough you got to be about two or three feet away from the lock or the battery will die within about two to three weeks so if you're gonna go and make a remote for a customer or a key and two weeks later he's gonna call you back and say his key doesn't work and you will know that it's a Chinese remote and we at Keycrest, we do not sell Chinese remotes. We only sell OEM boards. 